hey what is up everyone i hope all of you are doing great and in today's video we have two particles equal of equal mass m having unlike charges of modulus q that means one charge will be minus q and one will be plus q each are placed in free space a distance r not apart a uniform and constant magnetic field of induction b is established everywhere perpendicular to the line joining the particles and the particles are released okay uh, the magnetic field is sufficient to avoid collision of the particles find the minimum separation between the particles okay so i have already drawn the diagrams to save time so in this diagram we have two particles which were initially separated by a distance r not of uh, unlike charges but same magnitude so and the magnetic field is present in this direction okay such that the it is coming out from the screen and in the case of minimum separation the direction of the velocity will only be in the vertical direction or y direction let that speed be v and uh, as both the charges are having the same mass so the motion will be somewhat symmetric in nature so let us take the situation of any one charge okay i am taking a charge this one this negative charge here at this instant its velocity will be in this direction so it will have two components of velocity a vx and a vy okay and in the situation of minimum separation vy will only be present which will be equal to v and vx will turn out to be zero okay the magnetic field is in the k direction uh, sorry in the z, in the z direction that means coming out of the screen so if i write the force along y axis that would be see the electrostatic force at this instant the positive charge will be here so the electrostatic force on this negative charge will be in this direction the magnetic force will have two components one in the along the y direction and one along the negative x okay but i am interested in the forces along the y direction which will be due to vx so it will be q vx times b naught okay now it is b or b naught or b okay so that will be mass times acceleration along y that is mass times dvy dt okay so you can write qb by m vx can be written as dx dt where x is this one fine which is equal to dvy dt 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 gets cancelled out qb by m is dx equals dvy initially vy was 0 x was 0 and in the case of minimum separation the speed the whole velocity is along the y direction that is v and the value of x will be the value of x means this distance this distance is kitna uh, r not minus rm this one is rm divided by 2 okay so this is the distance final x final value of x so just put the value here it's r not minus rm divided by 2 so it becomes qb by m r not minus rm divided by 2 equals v okay so we have one equation here and another one we can use is energy conservation as we know the whole energy sorry the whole work is only done by the electrostatic force magnetic force is useless because it is perpendicular to the direction of motion of this particle or this particle uh, you can consider any one of them fine so the energy conservation initially there was only electrostatic potential energy between the two particles that was minus k e q square by r naught and in the situation of minimum separation they have both kinetic energy as well as electrostatic potential energy okay so this one is the kinetic energy term of each particle and times 2 because both of them will have same kinetic energy final potential energy initial potential energy 
so we can just modify the equation like this our final target is rm uh, r not equals m v square okay so we can just put the value of v from this equation and that would give you q square b square by 4 m square r not minus r m whole square okay so let us write it here q square r not r m r not minus r m so this gets cancelled out m m so we have q square also gets cancelled out fine okay so we have k e 4 m b square equals to r not r m times r not minus r m okay so this one is a constant let us consider it as alpha okay so minus r m square r not plus r m times r not square equals alpha so r m square r not minus r m r not square plus alpha equals to 0 and uh, r m will be minus r not square plus minus root over b square minus 4 r not alpha divided by 2 r not okay taking only the positive value and also taking r not square in common we have this one plus root over 1 minus 4 alpha divided by r not cube r not by 2 1 plus root over 1 minus 4 alpha was alpha was 4 m k e by b square so that gives you m by pi epsilon naught b square so just put the value m by pi epsilon naught b square r naught cube okay so this will be the value of minimum separation between the two charges during the journey okay so i hope you all have enjoyed the video if you like the video please do subscribe if you are new to this channel do share with your friends and teachers i hope you all do well in your examination good luck have a nice day bye